In the last 24 hours, the spread of coronavirus has been increased with at least uh, 27,000 new cases. Total number of cases has gone beyond 300,000. More than 14,000 persons have died globally. Gladly, nearly 97,000 persons are back on their feet after being infected with the coronavirus. As at today, only six countries have no case of COVID-19. 189 out of 195 countries of the world have at least one patient who is down with the virus. Though the numbers continue to alter, only five countries have about 90% of total deaths recorded today. Italy is back to the front row of pain with 651 deaths in one day. Other countries are Spain, Iran, the United States and the Netherlands. China has succeeded in keeping the outbreak in check, but the United States cannot say that much. Italy, Spain, Germany and Iran joined the list of countries with highest number of new infections. Here is, a, here is more on the global impact of COVID-19. Figures, Italy remains the hardest hit country outside China. The European country reported its first case on the 21st of February, but has overtaken China where the virus was first detected two months earlier. The worst affected Lombardy region reported nearly half of Italy's new cases and about 70% of the country's new deaths. Lombardy announced strict epidemic preventive measures in Italy to suspend nearly all office and commercial activities except those securing basic living, close all business sites other than food stores, newsstands and pharmacies, while prohibiting any gathering in public place. Spain has the highest daily death record of 344 on Sunday, and authorities are continuing to prepare more hospital beds, with hotels being converted into hospitals for people who are not seriously ill. The Ifena Exhibition Center in Madrid has been converted into a field hospital with 5,500 beds by the Spanish Military Emergency Response Unit. Germany is re-evaluating its coronavirus containment measures. The cabinet is planning a launch of supplementary budget of 150 billion euros on Monday as part of the bailout to tackle the impact of the COVID-19 pandemic. Death toll in France rose from 112 to 562. The country's Ministry of Health said the epidemic in France will reach its peak in five to eight days. French health minister said efforts will continue on increasing the country's storage of masks. The French ministry is also setting up a temporary medical center in the hard-hit town of Morhos. 30 intensive care units are being prepared near the main hospital in the town. Tons of medical supplies donated by China arrived in Athens in aid of Greece's battle against the epidemic. The aid consists of medical masks, surgical masks, protective suits, goggles, gloves, shoe covers, amongst others. Restrictions and bans have been imposed on land.